Hey guys, what's up? Cigar Buff coming back to you with a, another knife review here. Uh, this isn't new or anything, it's just me still going through the collection. Uh, a lot of people will recognize this knife, it's pretty popular, it's been known for a while now. Well, the type of model anyway. This is the CRKT Columbia River Knife and Tool M16. This is the Rescue Series, as you can tell it's orange, all the Rescue Series are orange. Um, this isn't G10, this is Glassfield Nylon. Um, this is the 12 ZER. Um, ER stands for Emergency Rescue. This is it. Sorry, that guy. It's got auto locks there. Black hardware, which is nice. I like that. Um, it's got their normal flipper. But, when you open it, most people are like, whoa, what is that? Did you polish that? No. It comes this way. It comes with a polished tantal blade, which is pretty pretty cool in my uh, opinion it's it's nice uh, it's different you know what I mean all other ways it definitely looks like showing here a normal M16 they also offer one with a glass breaker on the bottom and all that stuff it is liner locked with the auto locks which some people like some people don't um, yeah I really like this knife. It flip opens really, really well. Flip opens better than my other, better than my other M16. Um, and I didn't r screw with the pivot. I don't know. It's just really, it's very smooth, like effortless. So it's nice. Oh, and it's not no blade play or anything. So it's not like I screwed with the pivot there. Yeah, it's just I don't know. It's nice. Super sharp. Out of the box. Just dropped it. Uh, what can I tell you about it? This is 3 inch blade, which is nice. Um, it's not super thick. It's got the combo edge, obviously. I think it's like 3 millimeters or something. If that, I could be wrong. Anyways, yeah, it's pretty sweet. It's OS4, um, or AUS4. I always say OS. It's just what I do. <laughs> um, obviously the mirror polish, pretty cool. Not trying to blind you, just trying to show you the polish. Uh, sorry, just ate big dinner. Yummy. It's, it's round two that's coming right there. It's, uh, yeah, it's good times. Round three, I'm sure, would be nice too if you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> this has the triple point serrations on it, which is cool. As you guys know, I'm not a huge combo edge guy, but in this knife, it suits it. It's, uh, you know, the emergency rescue one. So, it's pretty cool. Os4, I don't have a, shit, I don't think I have a knife with Os4 except for this one. Uh, the Rockwell harness isn't crazy, it's not an amazing steel, you know, 55-57 on the Rockwell scale. Um, just what I like about it is, it's just a nice knife, it's 3.6 ounces. Um, the clip is, you know, typical M16 clip, not a huge, huge fan of it. Uh, but, you know, it does a job. I'm a big dude, so... Sometimes it rides when I sit down or get out of cars and it hits things and it bends it. I think I've bent this one already back. Or no, that was my other one. That was my other one. Yeah, so. Anyways, whatever. It's um, tip up. Uh, sorry, tip down carry only left and right sides. I think that's because of the shape of the the handles here at the bottom. Anyways. Um, what else can I tell you about it? Not much. There's no skeletonized liners or anything like that, obviously, or else. You would see it there, so they're saving weight in the handles. I'll show you the 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 edge on here. Like I said, it's it's factory. Just dropped it as I do all my knives. It's pretty sharp. If I wasn't a retard, there we go. So I mean, it, what the hell? Sorry guys, I grabbed the serrations there. So it's pretty good, you know what I mean? It's uh, not too shabby. It's alright. As I screw up, holy crap. Hold the phone, let's try this again. Alright, here we go. There we go. It's alright guys, it's not, you know, not going to whittle hair with this thing. Serrations I haven't really given her. Like I said, I don't really have combo knives usually, but... Oops. <laughs> yeah, they're they're sharp. <laughs> As you saw that. It went through like butter. Um yeah. Oops, let's put that back. 
Yeah, it's a pretty cool knife. It's different. It's, you know, it's a little flashy. Some people might not like that, but I like it. As you know, I like different things. I don't like a lot of my knives to uh, repeat themselves in look and feel and all that stuff. Steel's steel. A lot of my stuff's 8CR because I'm a cheap bastard, but <laughs> I have some S30Vs and hopefully soon a ZDP. Real soon. Um, that or an S90V. Paramilitary. We'll see. I don't know. Shit's expensive. I'm not working full time. We'll see what happens. Got something on the go though, guys. So pay attention. I will keep you up to date. Uh, gonna be starting business for myself. So gonna start something here. So, anyways, anyways, not a big deal. Doesn't concern you guys. I'm just saying. I'm. I've decided to go on my own and do uh, do a little something, something. I'll let you know when that time comes anyway, but... Yeah, that's it, guys. CRKT M16 ZER. Cool knife. I think I paid 34 bucks for this, I think. Yeah, 34 bucks plus shipping. I didn't buy this on my local knife dudes. Didn't have it in at the time. But I bought this a while ago anyway, so... Anyway, guys, that's it. Let me know if you have any questions. Please subscribe, like the video. You know what to do. Thanks.